Harrington. Today I want to talk about Windows 10 and about your old laptop. <sighs> For those that did not test their old laptops if they were able to run the consumer preview, well, you know, what many of us did not know was when Windows 10 customer preview was created and it was like in the news that Windows 10 could be downloaded and that testers could do you know testing and that it would send uh, information to Microsoft you know some people did not want to test it because maybe they thought hey if they install it on their computer they have a free operating system but that was not the case it was a test version and you know what <clears throat> something happened that many of us could not think of and that is that Microsoft in fact rewarded the testers with a complete free version of Windows 10 and because I am I am a kind of various tester I did some testing with my MacBooks you know I had two of my MacBooks running Windows 10 technical preview I now have something that in fact is impossible you know a MacBook that is activated with the latest Windows 10 and you know we are very grateful for that nevertheless you might think Windows 10 you need a very advanced computer for that and I did some testing and my speci specifications are uh, going lower with my videos <laughs> and I today have for you a Windows XP professional laptop this is a laptop with a legal serial number activated XP so I thought let's see if this baby that was created for Windows XP could also run Windows 10 and you know doing a thing like this of course will ask of you that you put at least the maximum amount of RAM in the thing this test was done on a Toshiba Satellite Pro and it's the L100 so let's take a look at it this laptop is so old that <laughs> the battery is completely dead. So I have to stick in the adapter. So let's take a look what a Windows XP laptop, this old thing here, will do with Windows 10. <clears throat> I will uh, start with telling you that this thing has 2 gigabytes of RAM and it's I don't know what to say you must take a look for yourself boom and uh, we are I must log in logging in I must be careful not to remove this <laughs> the whole screen is kind of little slobby but there you go you see this baby runs Windows 10 and uh, the sound driver uh, that we used uh, to let this work was an old sound driver and here you can see it was the sound driver of the Windows XP um, we used in here and of course you would like to see some specifications by the way, this is the latest Windows uh, 10, the 10,240, and there we go. I'm showing you, this runs fantastic on an old Toshiba L100 so you know assuming you also still have 
a Windows XP laptop and you still love the baby and you're like I don't want to update to you know a new laptop this thing is still very good and you love your little baby make sure you have enough memory installed in this thing we have two gigabytes of RAM I'm, I'm gonna close it now we have two gigabytes of RAM installed and um, this thing has only a what was it I think a 30 gigabytes hard drive not much or a 50 gigabytes hard drive this is a very it's a very old machine very special machine 50 gigabytes we don't see these hard drives anymore these days and um, as you could see Windows 10 runs fantastic on this baby uh, I even <clears throat> recorded some videos with it because I don't know if you could see it but um, I have all sorts of uh, I have all sorts of apps. Let me log in real fast. You see, the sleep function is also very good. In fact, <laughs> yeah, this is a fantastic, fantastic app. Eh? Even Balabolka is installed. She can read our news. And so, you know, also put my beautiful bottom bar. You see that? I have a special setup for my Windows systems. But um, <clears throat> in here, yeah, I can listen to my news. Eh? I can let it read to me, but I can record videos, desktop recordings. Um, this is a video that I created in here. Look at the quality. As you can see the screen is also not so shiny and so you know takes a while to load <laughs> there you go full HD with music see that and I can double click it and then I have a full screen it looks like the desktop itself you know, and that with the old computer that was created for uh, for a Windows XP, I think this is fantastic. I think that um, having an operating system like Windows 10 coming up for us in the future, some of us already have it with the thanks of my, uh, Microsoft, of course, and yeah, also thanks to ourselves that we also joined the project to test out and you know see what we could do with Windows 10 and you know have fun with it so that all is uh, yeah that all is very nice so in fact if you have an old laptop you know an old Celeron and this thing I don't even know what kind of processor this thing has the Intel Centrino duo processor so this was not some crazy laptop at that time it came with a Windows XP uh, license but this thing could also run Windows 7 fantastic I think je pense but Windows 10 runs good and I'm gonna put it aside and thank you all for watching of course if you think this video was kind of useful I think it was because you know installing the latest version of Windows in 2015 on an old Windows XP laptop I think that is a fantastic deal right anyway thanks for watching if you like this video of course like it subscribe to my channel and see you soon in my next video again bye